Hello. Hey, Kendra. What's your name? I'm Daniel. Daniel, where are you calling us from? From St. Louis, Missouri. St. Louis, what you do for a living? I am a general manager at an event company, and I am also an entrepreneur of a small multimedia business. General manager at an events company? Mm-hmm. And what else? And I have my own business, a media business. So I'm an entrepreneur. Own um, media business. Daniel St. Louis, general manager, events company, owns his own business. How old are you, Daniel? 25. 25. Do you have any kids? No kids. No kids. Well, they blowing you up. Your phone keeps <laughs> I see. Um, <laughs> and what's your, what is your birthday or zodiac sign? Um, it's August 6th. Um, I'm not into all that uh, zodiac stuff, though. August 6th. I think that's a Leo, but you say you're not into it. Okay. Oh, yeah, uh, yeah August 6th, I think it's a Leo. All right, but what kind of woman are you looking for? I'm a Christian, so I'm looking for a woman of God, um, somebody with interesting personality that's like can hold stimulating conversation, um, goofy personality, athletic, loves God. That's like the most important thing. Um, but those are like the main things I would say. What's up, deal breakers? Um, so honestly, I don't want anybody with kids. I want to be able to like create my own family. That's like something that's a deal breaker for me. Um, no drugs, no smoking weed. Um, and yeah, like you can't be a non-Christian. Like that's a deal breaker. You can't be a non-Christian. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So sisters, you, you spoke about it a couple of times. Are you following the principles? Like, are you not having sex when you get married? Yes. Are you a virgin? No. Okay, but you are um, going to wait again to have sex when you're married? Yes. Okay, you're 25. Could the woman have kids already? No kids. That's a deal breaker. Oh, kids are a deal breaker. Does she have to be in St. Louis? Um, no, she does not. I would prefer somewhere in the Midwest, but she doesn't have to be. Okay. And what's the age range you would date? I would say if she's mature, 23 up to maybe 30. 23 up to maybe 30. So this 23 up to 30, does she have to look a certain way? Um, she has to be pretty. I would find her attractive, but um, I would prefer a woman as athletic. So like we could go on hikes, adventures, stuff like that. But um, I'm not going to discriminate size, I would say. Okay. Does she got to make a certain amount of money? Um, I would say no, because um, I make a decent amount of money. But I would want her to have something going for herself, um, some type of passion or something she's working on. Okay. Let's do the Kendra cam. All right. I don't know if y'all can see me. Maybe if I. Wait, well, let me see. Hold on. I'm going to scoot back and put this on here and stand back. Okay. Can you see me? Yes. Um, all right, so this is Daniel St. Louis, general manager, um, 25, no kids. The woman, and, he, and you want kids when you get married. So the woman, you have a strong no kid policy. Yes. Okay. All right, so when was your last relationship? Uh, four years ago. Okay. You don't have to answer. When's the last time you was intimate with someone? Four years ago. Four years ago. Okay, he's serious about his Christianity. What's your favorite Bible verse? Romans 8, 28. And what it says it? that we know that all things work together for the good of those who love the Lord and are called according to his purpose. Come on now, come on, <laughs> come on. Jesus wept. Did they ever tell you you need a Bible verse? 
<laughs> That's the one you can use, people, if you can't think of one fast enough. Jesus wept. And I do know the virtuous lady verse, but we'll keep it going. Okay. <laughs> oh, Brad, uh, do you want to be a pastor? That's not something I desire. No. Okay. Okay. Yeah. You, know, you know the word. I like that. All <laughs> right. So, Daniel, why do you think you're single? I would say, honestly, the last four years, I've been really focusing on my, um, on my, just myself, um, health wise, mentally, emotionally, financially, just trying to build my credit and like, just build my life up really. Okay. Um, and what, um, why would I want to be lucky to be with you? I would say one, I'm a man of God. So that I feel like that trumps everything else. Um, I am a loyal person. Um, I'm intelligent, educated. Um, I'm a lover. I'm a treater. Like, like she should be treated. And I'm gonna be a great husband. And great. Okay, father. they want me to bring up back your request of an athletic woman. Mm -hmm. They're saying, how can you want an athletic woman? Um, and for two reasons. Um, one reason they're saying you're not as, as athletic, and the second reason is you don't want to have sex until marriage, and they feel like athletic women want to have sex. Look what they're saying in the comment section. Do you want to respond? I would say, one, I do work out. I have put on some pounds since COVID, but um, I do work out, and I am working on slimming down, but I am very active. Um, me and the fellas, we like, we go out, we like to do activities and like friends and stuff and family like like i said been outside nature stuff um but yeah i mean i say athletic maybe i should say somebody that's like physically active i don't want anybody that's like not gonna want to go outside not going to want to go on a hike not gonna like go to the park or go out okay okay all right so there you have it he was well he was willing to answer y'all questions and boop <laughs> all right so, Daniel, let's do it. Give them your Instagram page. It is Danny, D-A-N-N-Y underscore L-E-D. Danny underscore L-E-D. D-A-N-N-Y underscore L-E-D. D-A-N-N-Y underscore L-E-D. All right, Daniel. Let's see what it does, honey. Thanks, Kendra. All right. Bye, baby. All right. Bye-bye.